asked me to be her maid of honor, I was flattered. Then she asked me to give a speech. You too? <laughs> I'm not great at talking in front of crowds, so. Um, I tried to figure out ways to get out of it. But have, any, have you ever tried to say no to Mercedes and got away with it? <laughs> Didn't think so, so alas, here we are. <laughs> Um, I've known Mercedes since high school, although we didn't really know each other well then. Um, maybe just a couple of mutual friends, but boy, things have changed. Um, I don't know how I really survived life without having her as my best friend. Between the conversations that could go on for hours, and her trying to get me to loosen up and just relax and have a drink. Um, she's always been the most caring and protective friend. She literally would give up her sanity for me by taking my five soon-to-be-six kids without an issue. <laughs> um, Mercedes and Victor haven't always had it easy, but the love between them is strong. At the end of the day, they can always count on each other, through the good, the bad, and the ugly. Love is growing together. It's about caring and sharing, but also it's about a little bit of patience, maybe even a lot. <laughs> um, this is the start to a brand new chapter in your lives. Victor, one thing I can say, two most important replies. You're right, dear, and yes, go buy it. <laughs> so today is another great day to add to our collection of sweet memories, so I'm really looking forward to the cake. <laughs>